everyone, what's up? My name is Jess, and if you have never seen my face before, go ahead and click that subscribe button below because it helps me out so much. And I also have an Instagram right over here that I will be promoting until the day I die. So today's video is one that I'm very excited about and one that nobody wanted. Today, I am going to be panic dyeing my hair purple. And when I say panic dyeing, I mean that there's a lot of things going on in the world right now, a lot of stresses, and I'm just gonna insert this meme from Olaf that I found because I found that it was very uh, true. We are taking control of the things that we can control in a world the things that we can't control and that means dyeing my hair purple so if you guys are regulars to my channel you'll know that I work at the theme parks I work at Disney World and I work at Universal both places not really allowed to have colored hair or anything like fun that doesn't look natural so I'm dying my hair purple because I'm out of a job for at least another month, likely gonna be two. So in times like these, we go on sallys.com and we buy hair dye. So this is gonna be the hair dye that I'm using today. It is Arctic Fox in Purple Rain. I'm not pre-bleaching my hair or anything because after this is all over, I was planning to go blonde anyways. Right now I have like a ginger hair. Actually, I'll show you. So right now my hair is like ginger. It's it's pretty faded from like my normal like red. They actually discontinued the red that I used. Fun fact, I've gotten a couple questions from that video that I posted about like going ginger and a lot of you guys were asking about the hair dye and uh, yeah discontinued so I also don't know what I'm gonna do which is another reason why I just decided to go blonde but this is what we're starting out with right now it's about a level six seven is what the salon lady told me when I was going to go get my blonde done in the first place and then I had to cancel because I'm out of a job from the coronavirus so that's why we bought cheap hair dye online. So this is what we're starting with today. I am not pre-bleaching it because I actually want it to be slightly dark. I don't want like a super bright purple. I kind of want like, insert picture here, Mal from Maleficent, Maleficent? Mal from, what's the movie called? Mal from Descendants. I was watching that movie the other day and I realized how much I love her hair. So that's what we're doing today. I've been talking for far too long. Let's just get into this ish. I'm wearing this old, not old, actually it's pretty new, random t-shirt that I'm going to stain beautifully purple. I'm going to be using my Arctic Fox purple rain hair dye and let's go not ginger. Hello ladies and gents, this is the things, the things, these are the things that we have to do my hair. So like I said before, I've dyed my hair before, I dye it red, I'm actually a natural blonde, fun fact. Um, but I already have a bowl, so we're gonna use the bowl. I already have gloves. I think one of them has a hole in it, so we're just gonna, we're gonna forget that that's a thing. And I have a brush thing that I probably won't end up using, but it's nice to have. And I have a hair clip that is kind of coated in old hair dye, so like, cute. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this. Do you shake it? Okay, we're gonna, no, it doesn't shake. Okay, cool. Oh, it does smell like bubble gum-ish. I don't know if I'm a fan, or maybe it's grapes. Was it, it smells like something. It's not awful. It's better than like normal hair dye, so I'll take it. Is there a safety cap on the inside? Probably. <laughs> yeah, there is. Okay, I'm just dumb, it's fine. Yo, uh, look at this. Can we see? Oh my God, I'm so bad at this. I just don't wanna get it on my finger. Oh my God, it's so purple. Uh, oh my God. Okay, we're doing great. Oh yeah, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yes, here we go, there we go. Okay, we're good. So I'm just gonna put that here and wash my hands real quick because I don't want the purple already. Yep, already staining, cool. Okay, oh my God, that's potent. So I had it on my fingers for maybe two seconds and yeah, we're already, we're already there, but that's a good thing because that means it's gonna stick to my hair. So I'm gonna pour it in here. Oh, cool, okay. Let's do a little more, huh? Yeah. Let's go with that. Oh yeah, definitely grapes. It definitely smells like grapes. I'm using a fair bit for now. I'll probably add more. I have a lot of hair if you guys haven't noticed. It's not super thick, but well, it's it's like a medium thickness, but there's it's just like super long. So I got the bigger bottle because I'll probably end up using that whole thing. But this is here right now. It also said to probably use petroleum jelly so it doesn't like stain your ears and around your forehead. I also have a little bit of makeup on so that should act as a temporary barrier. But I have this like multi-purpose jelly that's not actually petroleum jelly, but it's like organic. So I'm not sure if this is gonna have the same effect. I would like to think it will. So we're just gonna put this on my whole face. So I'm gonna brush my hair. I cannot get a good angle with this camera right now, okay? I don't think it's like tall enough for me and I'm 5'3", so like, hello? Is that better? Is that even like even? We're just gonna go with it. If you couldn't tell, this is gonna be a mess of a video, but we're going with it because what else is there to do in total isolation? I literally have my roommate and my cats, which is not a bad combo, but obviously I'm dyeing my hair a bright color, a very different color than I've ever done before. So obviously I've gone insane. Not to say anything against 
colorful hair i love it it's just never been like my thing for me i like na the natural look which is why i went with like red because it's like this was like a natural ginger look but i've never done like a color color before besides like streaks in fifth grade so i'm really excited okay so i'm going ahead and sectioning my hair just a little bit to make it easier for myself and using this dirty clip that i probably should have washed better from the last time i dyed my hair it's fine just because this will make it easier to dye um i should also mention that my sister is a cosmetologist hairdresser person she does not live in this state which is why she's not doing this for me right now so if i'm doing anything wrong and she sees this i'm so sorry okay hair is sectioned which means it's time no it's not it's not time to get started we have to put the petroleum jelly all over my face this one's gross too because that's like kind of watery i feel like this is not gonna work why am i doing this i know why i'm doing this because i've gone absolutely insane oh this is gonna be so gross to get off it's really moisturizing though like if you have really really dry skin on like your nose or something i have a sinus infection currently at the moment so i've been blowing my nose like crazy and this i put this on like at night when it's like really bad and it really does it really does work brings moisture back and it's like organic and healthy it's alba botanica if you were wondering so we are going with a very cruelty free hairstyle today which i am all about oh my god that's so oh that's the worst feeling ever <laughs> Oh my god, I hate that. Okay, it's fine. I'm gonna be thankful that I did this. Ew, gross. Oh my god. It feels really not good. It'll be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. So I'm also gonna coat my neck in it because I just see horror videos of people with just stains everywhere. I am a pro. We are killing it so far. I think. Coated. <laughs> Ew, it's so gross. I coated everything here. My ears are very moist. And now I think it's time to get started. I'm gonna wash my hands though because... I like can't, can't believe I'm doing this right now. It's also a semi-permanent dye. I don't know if I mentioned that. So I don't know why I'm making such a big deal out of it. It's gonna come out. It's definitely gonna be a hot second before it comes out though. So, but like I said, I was already planning on dyeing my hair blonde anyways and going to a salon because I'm sure as heck not going to be doing that at home. I'm gonna go get it professionally blondified after this ordeal is over. But for now, purple. They make this so much easier on the TV shows. Okay. We have gloves. <laughs> okay, we have gloves. We have hair. Are we doing? Uh, yeah, why not, right? Okay, here. I'm gonna do the first part so you guys can see. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm gonna section it again and just put one side on this side. Oh, my hair is sticking to the petroleum jelly. I think that's a good thing. Yeah, definitely grape. No going back now, y'all. I've been waiting to do to do this all week. I decided like on Saturday night and it just got here and today's Thursday. Yep, so I'm gonna do this to the rest of my head. And oh my God, this is actually kind of fun. Okay, but I actually need to use like a real mirror. So cue the B-roll. Oh my god. So I did the whole thing. It smells delightful. I am covered in hair dye, so I didn't petroleum any of this. So I'm going to go and like attack my skin and try to get this off so it doesn't set. But I fully, she's fully covered. This is a little brighter. Like my bathroom lighting is super weird. I have a ring light over here just to get some better lighting. And I have like a window behind here. The lighting's not great, so like you can't really see it. It does look kind of bright, but like in here when i'm looking at it with like the real light it is darker i also think there's a little saturation in my camera so it's a little bit less vibrant but i'm really excited about it my shirt this is my new hair dye shirt so it's fine yeah she's all covered though and i gotta go help myself and get this off but i will come back shortly i don't know when but woohoo okay so we are here i have put a plastic bag on my head to avoid getting color on everything in my room since my room is white and light pink I don't want the purple everywhere so i did that i was able to get off most of the color um like on my ear there's still some on my neck but it's just the back of my neck and that'll come off in the shower and then all of the stuff around my forehead came off pretty easily so highly recommend vaseline or the off-brand organic petroleum jelly so i'm gonna wait 
for about an hour with this on my head. It's looking pretty bright, which I'm hype about, but also like this is not the realistic color of what it's gonna be like. I like can't believe I did this. I'm really proud of myself, okay? So I'm gonna wait probably about an hour just to make sure it's like good and stuck in there. I should probably read the bottle and see what it says, but most people were saying like an hour. And again, I don't want like a super, super, super vibrant color. So I don't, I don't need to wait like three hours or however long people are saying. I don't think you even need to wait that long, but maybe an hour I think is good to wait. Again, my hair was a little darker before we even started so it's not gonna be super bright which I am pumped about because again I want to look like Dove Cameron because she's beautiful <laughs> so I'm gonna hang out in my shirt and I will update you guys when it's time to update you guys I'm so excited oh my god okay friends it has been an hour it's almost 2 30 right now and oh my god I'm so excited and yeah I'm gonna take this out so I'm gonna go wash this out now and then I will see you when it's all done and when I style it and when I put on like makeup and look nice so um, I'm gonna do the, this little hand thing as a transition so the next time you see me I'm gonna look really cool fingers crossed <laughs> hello friends <laughs> So this is the final color. It's actually darker than I thought it was going to turn out, but I like it. She's purple. Um, I definitely have some staining around just like in, in my hair area type of deal, but like you can't really see it. Sorry, I've just like been playing with it because I've never seen myself like this before. So I'm about it. I actually really like how it turned out. It was a little bit messy. If you guys can see, my nails are crazy purple right now. My hands are a little bit purple, but like not bad. I don't know what else to say besides this is her. This is the look. I have my ring light on, but it still looks a little dark. So I'm excited to see what it looks like when I go outside. Um, I do have a big window over here, but it's definitely a different thing when I like leave my apartment. Let me see if I can just like move this light a little bit. You guys can see the color. There you go. Yeah, so this is like really bright right here, but that's gonna fade um, in like one wash. Yeah, so this is the color. Purple rain on ginger hair. I am happy with it. Like I said at the beginning of this video, this is definitely not like a permanent thing. However, I thought I'd give myself something to do during quarantine and dyeing my hair purple was that something to do. So this is it. I hope you guys liked this video. This was very fun to film and very fun to do. I just wanna go out now and like go like see people, but like I can't. So maybe Ryan and I will go to Whole Foods to get dinner and see if anyone looks at me. I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna stop rambling. Sorry, I haven't been like looking at you guys. I've just been like looking at myself in the viewfinder, which I know is annoying. I'm really happy with the turnout. I like it a lot. I think it's super fun and was pretty much the color I was going for, so. 10 out of 10, a good way to spend my day. Yeah, so I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, if you guys are not already subscribed, go ahead and click the subscribe button below because it helps me out so much. Come and join the fam. We don't always dye our hair, but sometimes we do. And also go follow me on Instagram where I am sure that I will have already posted many a photo with this hair. But again, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.